replacement surgeries, we've been performing them over the past many decades with a very good rate of success in restoring their mobility and most patients have been happy after a joint replacement surgery. The question comes, how can we improve the outcomes? How can we make it more precise? Over the last couple of decades, robotic joint replacement surgery is that a preoperative imaging is performed before you undergo surgery and this imaging is uh, fed into a computer which keeps a plan ready. The plan is usually customized for each patient and it matches with the implants that are available and helps us place the implant in the ideal place. So what we do during a robotic joint replacement surgery is that we take a CT scan before uh, your surgery and there are softwares into which your CT scan is uploaded. It gives us a 3D plan and that is ready before uh, we start surgery. So during surgery, we match this 3D plan along with a real-time navigation that enables us to perform accurate cuts, align the joints more precisely at the same time preserving the undamaged tissues. Robotic surgery and a conventional surgery usually takes the same amount of time. A robotic surgery is better in patients who have advanced arthritis and very stiff joints with a very bad deformity. The other advantage is the ability of a robotic surgery to create a customized surgical plan and choose the ideal implant even before we start surgery. So what happens during joint replacement surgery is that um, the surgeon prepares the surface of bones and aligns the joints. So in a traditional joint replacement surgery, what we would do is we would use traditional templates and cutting jigs to cut the bone surfaces and then align the joint. But with the uh, advent of robotic joint replacement surgery, what we do is preoperatively we do some imaging procedures and that will enable us to plan in a three-dimensional way, uh, which is assisted with real-time computer navigation during surgery. Using robotic tools that have sensory feedback, the surgeon can remove the damaged bone and cartilage more accurately than it was uh, done in the traditional way. So it adds precision as well as it preserves the undamaged tissues.